The reasons for termination of pregnancy can be many. It could be due to health concerns, fetal anomalies, if the pregnancy is unintended, etc. But let's not forget that since female infanticide that's killing the girl child in the womb is common in our country, it also serves as a big reason for abortions in many parts of the country. In India, the Medical Termination of Pregnancy Act 1971 is an act that deals with issues arising out of pregnancies and abortion. Coming to the situation in which termination is absolutely necessary and in the best interest of the mother and child, the courts are lenient and sympathetic. But in a case involving a 24-week-old pregnancy of a married woman, the court, while considering a plea for medical termination of pregnancy, orally remarked that if such a plea is allowed, it will encourage parents to show disinterest in having a child at the last moment. The woman told the court that she cannot raise a child because of some illness. The court issued notice in the plea and directed a medical board to be constituted by AIMS to assess the medical condition of the petitioner. But at the same time, it remarked that there is a difference between forced pregnancy as a result of assault and a voluntary pregnancy. Meanwhile, Justice Nagaratna asked the counsel for the petitioner that in case the pregnancy is voluntary and happens after marriage, what should be done in such a situation? To know what happens in the case, stay tuned to Live Law. We'll be back with an update on the case.